Last year when we reported Reykjavik is in danger, it was from the North Meridory Valley, one of those valleys that is at the corner, tucked away from the everything else, the lowest point. Now, is, is in this one of those North Meridory Valleys, the eruption, the fissure eruption that is happening. And, uh, but is in line with the Fagrades Fjol and the actual uh, Natai Valley. So practically it may, if it, if it can actually overwhelm fill up the valley north side of the uh, Fagadesvia volcano, it will overflow from there toward the north. For it is actually is easier now to go toward the north because the south part, south route, is actually taken by the, by the volcano itself and the flanks of it and the shield it has built. As you can see in this panorama image, I'm showing the line of the uh, horizon both sides of it is sea, west is exactly opposite us. The Reckonus Peninsula, this is the geography of it. And from there, if you look toward the new fissure eruption, what we will see is this. A new fissure eruption happening to the left side of this image, you can see that. It has to rise to the level higher than that, then go over it toward the Reykjavik. Other route is that continue at the center of the image, flow toward the left side, uh, toward the right side, and there from the, one of those Meridolo valleys, again, over spill toward the north, is easier to go toward the north, fill up in that valley, spread in that valley, that's easier for it, toward the Kaler volcano, I mean the former volcano is not active anymore, or uh, fill up gradually the valley and just flow toward south, one of those vertical faces that is a fault line flows uh, south toward the ocean. That's another route anyway. These are speculations. We will have to wait and see.